All right, so uh, we're back, and we are going to. Oh, well, first we're gonna put the ink ribbon away. You don't notice that much of a. You don't notice any change. Okay, well. Supposed to be, I raised it about, the audio level I raised about 10%, so I don't know. Oh god, the re fucking repeating dogs again. Oh. Wow. God damn it. Went the wrong way again. Will you descend into madness? Okay, good. I still have the crank. I almost forgot to uh, use the crank. In fact, wait a second. Oh, hey, Barry. Oh, Jill. What good timing. A moment ago, I heard someone's voice coming from this hole. Let's go together since it's dark and we can't see very well. Yes, let's. Will you go with Barry to the hole? Yeah, I guess okay, so. Let's go. Okay. Then I'm gonna cover you. Let's hurry! Hey, are you alright? I can go first if you want me to. Want him to go first? Uh. Yes, I guess. Oh, yes, please. I'm a little nervous. Well, I understand. Yeah, yeah. Maybe more dangerous if you come behind me. <laughs> Be careful. <laughs> Come behind me, yes. Ooh, Barry, I didn't know you were into those kind of ki into that kinky shit. Barry? Oh shit! What happened? No, Barry. What you do? Maybe I should have gone first. Damn, Barry, you suck. You needed two shots. That was too close. Let's go together. Okay, let's go. You almost became okay. a hunter sandwich. Let's hurry. All right. That's kind of weird music playing. It is extremely dark in this area. Power generator, but does not. It's power generator, but does not work. First aid spray. Yes, I will take. That's a power. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yes. Yes, I understand. Oh. Uh, I believe it's this door. Enrico's? Yeah? You're alive! Wait there! Are you with anybody, Jill? What? Oh, yes! Enrico! So, Barry and Jill together. Are you alright, Enrico? The stars are doomed. <laughs> That's what the long pause is. Everything was plotted from the start by Umbrella. Huh? Oh shit, the wall shot him. Enrico! <sighs> yeah.
You know, it's um, when I used to play this back on PlayStation, I used to give it some slack because I thought that the long pauses was the disc trying to read. <laughs> but now it's actually, now that I realize it's in the game and this is not running off a disc, it's just, oh my god. <laughs> it's just really funny now. It's like, Barry, can you make me a sandwich? Pause. Okay. <laughs> he couldn't have moved because of this injury. He's holding something. What is he holding? I don't remember if Enrico can be saved. I, th I thought he could. Maybe he can't. It's pretty cool in Resident Evil Zero you get to see what he actually looks like. Um, you know. With uh, better graphics and stuff. And uh, he's actually... Uh, you know, well, not a playable character. He's an NPC in Resident Evil Zero, but I think it's pretty cool that they actually have him in, uh, in one of the other Resident Evil games. Is that another crank? I already have one. Will you take the crank? Why do I have two? Alright, you know what? I'm gonna equip my rocket launcher. Or bazooka. Yeah. Bazooka. Because I believe there's gonna be a hunter gonna pop up. And I was right. Hey, what's up? Oh shit, there's another one. Where's he at? Where you at, bro? Fuck. Oh shit! Oh shiitake! Oh fuck you! Oh fuck you, bro. Fuck you. <laughs> Wait a second. Hold on. Isn't there another door? Yeah, I think I missed one of the doors over here. Let's see what's over here. Oh, crap. You better die. Fuck that noise. Oh, okay, wait, no, we just came full circle. Alright. Alright, we're gonna use the crank. Don't know why I have two of them, but... Ah, wait, let me check. See, uh, I think one of them is not a hexagon. See, so square. Oh, shit. See, if I try to use it, it won't work, right? Yeah, I can't use it here. That's why. That's why there's two different cranks. Crank the power. Crank that power. If I'm not mistaken, if, if I do it again, I believe there's like a hidden thing. Or I might be wrong. I thought there would be a secret item. I like it would like it would I'd be able to walk sideways, but apparently I was wrong. All right, maybe that's in the GameCube version. Can I skip this? I can't skip. Okay. 
Or maybe it's the ranged game. I wonder if I should actually go, uh... Yeah, let's go drop... I don't know. Well, let's go ahead and see if there's a, a box nearby. I was gonna run back to the garden house, but I wasn't too sure if there was uh, another box up ahead. Oh, fucking, a, a fucking boulder, dude. Oh, shit. Well, what the fuck do I do with this thing? Ah, oh, fucking hell, now it's moving. Oh, snap! <laughs> oh my god. That would have sucked. Oh, shit. Fuck you. If there's anything over here. What is this? Ugh, can't carry it. Crank the power. Oh shit. I forgot. Dead. Oh, that was kind of a pain in the ass. Oh god, it's babies. I have two combat knives. Ah, babies! Oh my god. Stop it. Go away. They're just, dude, I don't even have to do anything. They're just killing themselves. The fuck? Come on. Die. Last one. God, I really hope there's a crate past this point. Oh, thank God. I think I'll mix uh, two green and a blue. I'm not in red yet, so... There we go. Alright, we're going to, uh... Make sure to pick up those flame rounds. That's for damn sure. And where's that first aid spray? I just put it away. What the hell? Alright, I need those flame rounds. There we go. Flame rounds. Alright. And there's additional flame rounds. Oh. We're not going to save just yet. 
I'm gonna go backtrack a little bit, a little bit, and grab those flame rounds, and then we will save. Stream is quiet tonight. Little too quiet. I think we're good. All right. Oh, you're playing a game while watching the stream. That's cool. No problem. Hey, put everything in order. Never. I will not have. What the fuck? Oh my god, snakes! Holy shit! Where the fuck are they falling from? <laughs> Oh my god, that was totally unexpected, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. Snakes, man, you can never be too careful. They'll just fall out of nowhere. Completely own your ass. They're usually quiet, no problem. No problem. Alright, let's see if there's anything else. Alright, we got flame rounds. We got our shoddy. We got a lot of ammo. I actually have ridiculous amount of ammo now. Alright, on to the lab. Oh, you know what? I forgot to grab the, uh... Oh my god. I forgot to grab the, uh, emblem. We're gonna need that. And we will save. <laughs> Snakes on a motherfucking plane. Snakes in a motherfucking cave. Yes. I miss the ink ribbons. I thought the ink ribbons was pretty cool. It made you uh, think twice about saving, you know. I've only ever gotten into a situation once where I used all my ink ribbons when I first played Resident Evil, and I didn't know what the ink ribbons did. I was just saving like crazy, cause cause I was a little kid, and like every time I killed a zombie, I would go back and save. <laughs> so, yeah, I thought that was kind of funny. I should be able to dual wield knives, man. Come on, it's bullshit. I don't think we need the MO disc yet, just yet. But we definitely need that emblem. Those quiet ones are the ones you gotta watch out for, totally. Oh, shit! Oh, fucking hell. This was the part. Ah, crap. I gotta grab the crank again. Son of a bitch. I forgot about the crank. I better not get bit, because that would suck.
That that was the part I was talking about earlier, where you can move the uh, crank so the boulder will fall. And you don't get crushed by it. Wait, is this the he I gotta make sure this is the hexagon one. That looks like it. All right, we're good. Holy crap, that one almost got me. What? Bullshit. Why? Uh, I'm using the fucking crank on it. What? Dude, what the fuck? There's a hexagon hole. I'm using the fucking hex crank. What, why can't I use it? I'm missing something here. Okay, that was weird. I believe it has to be this way, because then you have to dodge it. Yeah. Oh, it's going to hit the cameraman! Poor camera guy. I just got another Mo disc. Don't mess with the crank. It has power. Crank has power. The almighty power. Now I believe if I crank it to the left side, there is some extra goodies. Or, you know, I should just fall through the hole. That might be a good idea. Oops. Fall through the hole. Ooh, there's actually a door here. Huh. Is this a puzzle? This is a puzzle. What is this? Fuck. What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Oh my god, something... Oh shit, what the fuck was that? Um... If, what happens if I use the hexagon here? Ah, I see. It's to push it because for some fucking reason, Jill cannot pull stuff. Would that be considered 3D back in the day? Well, technically this still is a 3D game because you can you can move in third dimensions, so. Resident Evil. Uncapable of pulling objects, no matter how big or small. Like, seriously, you can't just slightly pull the fucking thing, Jill. It's not that hard to figure out. What is this? Can't carry it. Son of a bitch. Uh, 
I guess we gotta go all the way back. Alright, talking about the boulder hitting. I guess that would be considered 3D. Why not? Who the fuck would put a giant boulder here? Seriously. I don't think I'm going to need the crank anymore. Pretty sure I'm not going to need it anymore. Did he add a Jones away? I guess, the, well, the mixture of boulders and snakes, uh, pretty sure that'd keep Indiana Jones far away from this, uh, mansion. Are you fucking kidding? Oh my god, fuck you, game. Wow. That is bullshit. That is some fucking... Oh my god, that is fucking horseshit, dude. They reset the goddamn puzzle. Now I gotta go all the way back, grab the fucking crank. This is dumb. Who the fuck did this? What zombie pushed the fucking statue back into place? What an asshole. What an... Oh my god. That's so stupid. Magic fucking resetting rooms. As soon as you leave, the puzzle resets. Makes total sense. That is fucking lame. I gotta do the whole puzzle all over again. Tired of these motherfucking snakes. Man, they suck. They haven't bit me once. <laughs> Games back then weren't very forgiving. Uh, there's a difference between forgiving and just plain stupid bullshit. That is just stupid shit. But yeah. Uh, I'm gonna do this again. Skip this, no. Oops. Oh my god, all this for a book. The Doom Book. There should be another emblem in here, I believe. Alright, so we got the silver and the gold. Wolf Metal. Metal from the second Doom Book. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh my god, hell yeah, NES games were not forgiving at all. Once you ran out of lives, you're pretty much screwed. Alright, um... Nah, just go ahead. Let's just go through here. We don't need to go back. I'm not gonna risk getting bit by those snakes. What's up, Power and Soul? Welcome to the stream, bro. It's welded and does not open. Well, try harder. Come on, you're the master unlocking, you dumb bitch. Oh, 
Picture of an eagle. Well, definitely got to put the wolf one there. Definitely. Now, this is a cool cutscene coming up. When I first saw this, I was like, wow, that's pretty neat. Okay, not 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 so much now, but <laughs> trust me, back in 1996, it was pretty cool. Uh, you didn't miss much. I started. Uh, well, I got through the tunnel and I defeated the spider boss, which was actually relatively easy. You know, we're just gonna mix two green. I got I got so many herbs in my inventory, it doesn't even matter. Nope, not that. No. Will you pick up the green herb, Jill? God damn yeah, squat on it. That's how you pick stuff up. I like how the the res uh the other Resident Evils actually showed you the different, uh, two different piles. Like, if you mix two green and a blue, there'd be a, a bigger green pile and a smaller blue one. This one's just kind of weird. It's just, they just change color. It's kind of strange. Alright, let's go down. Alright, we're, uh, this is the final part of the game. The final level. The lab. And this is where we're probably going to be using the Magnum. A lot. Because the enemies down here are pretty... Pretty fierce. <laughs> Spider fight and two boulders. Maybe Fuchsia prefers the squat. Drop your dookie on them plants! Door is tightly shut. Place on the right. Is there... No, damn it. Never mind. Now, I believe Chris is, uh, if we save Chris, we get the good ending. Chris and Barry, I think, are the people you can save. I'm pretty sure they're the only people you can save. Alright, where's our type? There's no typewriter here? Fucking bullshit. Alright, well, we don't need the crank anymore. Uh, we don't need this right now. Alright, we're good. We'll just, uh, use whatever rocket launcher stuff we have, I guess. Save the magnum. We'll save the magnum for the final boss. That way we can just fucking kill him easy. I could have sworn there's a typewriter here, but I guess I was wrong. Alright. What's up, man? Come here. Come here. Come on. Oh, you want to face the other way? There we go. Don't lose your head, soldier. Oh, you know what? We should grab the ammo discs. Forgot about that. Well, you know, actually, let's go in this door over here first. Three ammo discs. Do I use it on here? Let's, let's check this one. I'm not too sure. I think they're all different, that's why. This needs to be a startup disc. Alright, never mind. It's an electronic lock. Alright, well, let's put these herbs away and let's grab the other ammo discs. Thanks to Kawa Marco for following me on Twitch. Thank you very much, dude.
All right, I don't even give a shit. I'm just putting... I think I filled my entire inventory. <laughs> I don't have any... Look, I literally have no fucking room now. <laughs> my God. Okay, um... Where's the other ammo discs? I believe there's four total. Oh, but I'm not gonna have any room for anything else. Shit. Huh. Oh well. Let's go. The long ass, super slow walking down the stairs. Uh, I don't remember if this guy. Oh shit, naked zombies. Put some pants on, boy. What's wrong with you? Ah, oh, dude. I don't want to see that zombie's crotch. What the fuck? Where are you going, you dumbass? <laughs> oh my god, dude. First we get naked zombie crotch. Oh my god, that polygon ass. Ah, fuck waste. He wasn't close enough. Another one around here. Oh. All right, let's go through this door first. It's locked. It's locked. This door is tightly shut, locked. Which, which door do we go through? I don't remember. This one? I know this is where Chris is. Should have thrown the keys away. Never. Okay. I think this room's dark enough. Holy shit. Come on, I see an herb right there. Pick it up, Jill. Damn you, you don't have enough room. Uh oh. Why is it blue? That is a weird color. Something is written on the picture. Tree, apple, man, woman. Uh oh, there's nudity on, on my stream. I'm gonna get in trouble. What's up, Hairball321? Oh, you guys don't report me. There's two, two naked, poorly rendered people on screen on a map that is oh researchers letter June 8th 19 1998 dear Ada oh my god I, ho I wonder who that is dear Ada Ada by the time you read this uh, I'll be something different today's tests turned out to be a positive just I just as I expected I feel like I'm going crazy when I think about becoming one of them. Ada, you're not infected, and I hope you never will be. In case you're the last one left, take the materia. I mean, materia. <laughs> oh my god, wrong game. This is totally Final Fantasy VII. Take the material in the visual data room and go to the power, the power, power room to operate the triggering system before you escape. And make all this... Hey, you never started a sentence with and. What's wrong with you, Capcom? And make all this public. Make, and make all this public through the meat. What the fuck? That is, okay. That is a terrible typo. If everything is in order, all the locks can be opened by the security system. You can access the system if you log in with my name from the terminal. In the small, in the terminal, in the small lab, enter the password. The password is your name. 
To unlock the door at B2 where the visual data room is lo is located, you'll need to access you'll need to access with our names first, then enter another password. I've written the code below. I'm sure you'll understand it easily. And this is my last hope. If you find me com completely changed, please kill you. <laughs> please kill me yourself. I'm pretty sure half of that shit was badly written. Yours, John. John who? J Marcus? John Ada. Oh, we know Ada, Ada Wong. Oh, shit, I don't want that. Let's look at that again. M, that symbol, and then... What the fuck? Okay. Wait, hold on. Let's, let's turn this off, see what happens. Aha! There we go. So that was M. So M Q L E male. <coughs> I think it's male. No, 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 wait, wait. M, because that one's, okay, wait, M-O-L-E, mole. I think it's mole. Let me look at it one more time. Yeah, there's that weird, okay, yeah. I think it's mole. Because uh, bottom left is man, so that's an M. The next word is, is an O, because it's on woman, so... M O, there's that weird squiggly line near Apple. That's an L, and then the last one's an M. So that's an E. So Mole. So Ada Wong and John Mole, I believe, is the password. That's a horrible last name. All right. I'm just curious. What happens if I uh, turn this on and turn the red off? time. Yeah, it's Mole. It's gotta be Mole. Yeah, it has to be. Alright, Ada Wong and John Mole. That pixel. Passcode. Wait, can I use the embo discs here? No, I cannot. It's locked. Alright, we gotta find the terminal now. Oh, what the fuck? Still alive? I thought I killed all of them. What? Did they respawn? You're fucking kidding me, right? 